What's up, everybody? Welcome to Hopped LA Events on Tap, episode 36, covering all the awesome things happening in LA beer this week. So today, we are at Aero Lodge Brewing, who have been open for just over a year out here in Covina, California. So we first experienced their beers at last year's LA Beer and Food Fest. Then they got back on our radar when after a Dodger game, we popped into Sunset Beer Co. in Echo Park and had Clayton Kerhop on yeah. tap. And that was a delicious beer. So the hype, it's growing, it's real. Plus, our buddy Guillermo is a tap room manager over here. So we wanted to come out here and see it for ourselves. Yeah, and the head brewer here, Amy Heller, is killing it. So many great beers here on tap today. Uh, she started out in the wine world and got into beer down here at Congregation Ale House and now is just doing a great job here at Aero Lodge. They're putting out new can releases, but it seems like every other week. And the tap room here is super cool. I feel like I'm in a wood lodge up in the mountains, uh, but with really good beer. So speaking of awesome beer, we had to get a couple pours. What are you drinking? So right now I'm drinking Heller's Lager. It's a little bit sweet, a little bit spicy, and so crisp and refreshing. Perfect for a fucking hot day like today. Uh, but what are you drinking, man? So I am doing Mojo So Dope, which is in cans right here. This is a double New England style IPA packed with some of my favorite hops. Too many to name right now, but it's big, it's juicy, it's jammy, just fucking delicious. Show them that color too. Haze for days. Crowbar's up. So if you guys follow us on Instagram, you've probably been seeing us teasing our brand new merch line coming out this week. We're super excited to debut this one, and you guys can pick up some of these new threads at Indie Brewing Company this Thursday or this Saturday at the LA Beer Week Kickoff Festival. We'll be there with a booth slanging these things left and right. But if you can't wait, you can go to hopdla.com slash store right now and pick yours up. But why don't you just visit us in person on Thursday or Saturday, save on shipping, and say what up to your boys. And some more exciting news, our LA Beer Week collaboration beer with Indie Brewing Company is launching this week. And like years past, this beer is gonna be nice and hoppy for you guys. Introducing Hopped L Apricot Pale Ale. I really think you guys are gonna like this one. It's hoppy, it's hazy, it's fruity, and it's delicious. So head on out to Indie Brewing Company on Thursday, starting at 6 p.m and have a beer with us. Time to get into the events portion of the show. Starting with Friday, June 15th at 4.30 p.m., Safland Beer is tapping a cask of Unity Beer. This is the All LA Brewers collaboration beer, and Southland Beer is the only place outside of LA Ale Works, which brewed the beer, to have a cask of it. Super special. It'll be one of the only chances to have this specific beer in a very unique way. So check out Southland Beer on Friday. Then on Saturday the 16th, LA Beer Week kicks off with the kickoff festival at LA Center Studios. We've talked about this one already. It's one of the best beer events of the year. So just pick up tickets and go. We'll be there. So we'll be looking out for you. Come by our booth, say hi, grab some merch and enjoy the fest. And then after the fest, Head over to McKellar in downtown because they are tapping a very rare keg of Florence from Hill Farmstead. This acclaimed brewery never comes out to Los Angeles. So this is kind of a once in a lifetime type of deal. So highly recommend you check that one out. Then on Sunday, June 17th, it's McLeod's fourth anniversary celebration and they're having a cask festival. So they do this one every year and it seems like it just gets better and better. Um, dozens of local LA breweries bringing special one-off cast beers for you to enjoy. They'll have food, they'll have live music. So buy your tickets, head on down to Van Nuys and celebrate McLeod's fourth anniversary. It's gonna be a good time. So that does it for this week's events. Let's head into the previews section of the show. Previews, previews, previews. previews. Starting with Wednesday, June 20th, we've teamed up with Tony's Darts Away to bring you guys a local hops night. It's been a couple years since we've done an LA Beer Week event. So for this one, we've curated a awesome tap list full of some of LA's best hoppy beers. Including our collaboration with Indy. Yes. Not only that, but we're gonna have a little pop-up shop there. We're gonna be selling our new merch. So definitely come by, say hello, 
hang out, drink some awesome beer at Tony's, which is always a great spot to hang out at. Hope to see you guys there. If you like hops, don't miss it. Yeah, don't miss it. And then next up, it's LA Beer Week. There's dozens and dozens and dozens of awesome beer events going on all week long. It would take us 40 more minutes just to get through it all. So what we did is we put together our list of our favorite events for each day of the week. So head over to hoppedla.com slash LABW guide to check out all the places that we recommend going for the week. Uh, one that we really do want to call out though is on Saturday the 23rd at Celador. They're having a Sour Friends Fest where they've basically brought in some of the best sour beer producers in Southern California to pour some really awesome, tart, sour, funky, wild ales. They don't open their doors very often, and when they do, they bring it hard. So tickets are 35 bucks, buy yours, check it out on Saturday. So that does it for this episode of Events on Tap. There are far too many beers in that list that we haven't tried yet, so time to head back in and uh, try some more stuff. So drink indie and drink local.